Yandere Simulator. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, 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 the game that will never be finished. Now, the reason I'm saying that Yandere Simulator is never gonna be finished is because I'm saying like those really good gaming computers. I don't know the exact name for them. You know the one that popular YouTubers use. Those type of gaming computers. One, the game kind of lags on even those computers. And just imagine how it would be for people that have computers that are lower than that. It would be even more laggy. Programming in the game is not put together well. It's basically like a Jenga tower that's getting ready to be knocked down and it's held by like one block. That's how bad the programming is. That's why there's so many glitches in the game and everything. It's not just the glitches. It's the community as well. If people don't get what they want, they'll go take their money and pay for it somewhere else. Pay for sponsors somewhere else. Pay for Patreon somewhere else if they don't get what they want. Those of you that are waiting for Yandere Simulator and Osana to be in implemented into the game, just so you know, right now, that game is never going to be finished because because he's just gonna keep, Yandere Dev is just gonna keep adding more and more new features and up, but never get to finish the actual game. Even if the game is very close to being finished, it's never gonna be finished. It's gonna always stay in like beta alpha mode. That's where it is right now. There are these people, because of that reason I just explained, there are making a game, I don't know the exact, but basically they're making a game, in other words, uh, Lovesick, and I don't mean Yandere Simulator Lovesick, it's a game that's like Yandere Simulator, but it's not. It's called Watashi no Mono. And if I get it wrong again, I'll put it on this. They're making it, and um, it's not gonna take as long as Yandere Dev, because the game hasn't had a major update, and when I say major, I mean like major update, like new characters. Well, there are new characters, but I'm saying like major major. I think Yandere Dev has just been procrastinating to finish any of it that's why he just keeps adding updates you're adding all these updates and everything but you're not working on the actual game osana is probably never gonna be implemented and if she does that's gonna be a surprise but yeah there's going to be uh, a game called lovesick and they said like on twitter i believe or somewhere else i just heard it when i was just looking for something to watch and then it came up and i recommended it said the game's gonna be finished in like two weeks and right now i'll show it on the screen the game looks pretty good in my opinion it's pretty smooth i know it looks similar to yandere simulator but it's not exactly and then um of course yandere dev responded and his reaction to these people making this game that's based off Yandere Simulator basically wasn't very good. He said stuff like, um, you're using my game as a base and not making, from, making it from scratch like I did. Uh, what else? I, I believe that he also told them that they should stop working on the game because, like, they're gonna beat him in competition, something like that. I'm not completely sure, but basically it's, it is like Yandere Simulator, but not exactly. Yandere Simulator will never be finished. That's not a complete fact. The game's progress is way back. It's, it's way back. Yandere Dev has been procrastinating to finish the game. Of how long we've been waiting, we've been waiting for a decade for this game to be finished. So don't get your hopes up high. And if it does get finished, that's gonna be a surprise for literally everyone. Yandere Dev procrastinates, the coding is bad, and the game will never be finished. That's all I had to say for this video. I just wanted to talk about this situation because it keeps popping up literally everywhere. So, um, yeah. But that's alright. Hush.